Hi, I've been playing with using Sonic Pi with a visualizer which is written in processing. Um, this is based on a little um, processing sketch which I found on the internet and I've modified slightly, added some color and changed the sizing and so on. <coughs> but it gives a very nice visualization of Sonic Pi playing and in order to uh, um, adjust things I'm uh, using my Touch uh, C controller to control um, the playback of a MIDI file by Sonic Pi. Uh, the individual synths are produced by Sonic Pi and the levels and various other parameters can be changed using this program. So let's start it off, look at the visualization and see what you think. So what if I reduce the uh, sound coming in there, turn off all the channels, visualization disappears. We'll turn on one of them. Others. Off the tube there. If we change the parameters, we get quite a lot of subtle changes taking place. So many things to interact. You can adjust the sensitivity of the sketch. There are three uh, little controls up at the top here. They're actually behind Sonic Pi, so I can't click on them at the moment. But you can adjust these to get different uh, shapes to the pattern. You can scale up the ADSR envelopes. And stuff different ways. I don't know if that makes that perfect in it. We do because it's a stereo input, I think, to the. Uh... Try some different sounds. Can't tax this. This is a lot of uh, stuff running. The video recorder. Um, there's uh, audio hijack running to feed Sonic Pi into the video recording. There's processing running. There's uh, QuickTime running to show, show my iPad. There's MIDI X player running, and there's Sonic Pi running. So the poor old computer is really going through the works. We'll stop this from playing back at the end, so it comes to a stop at the end.
And there we have it. Hope you've enjoyed the video. Lots of fun playing around with visualization.